Assalamu alaikum dear viewers Welcome in today's discussion session The topic of today's discussion is How to launch a new product first time in Bangladesh Our discussion is divided into four parts The first is what is a new product The second what features need to be evaluated to select a promising new product? The third is from where to get the information about a promising product. And finally, major regulatory bodies in new product launching. As per WHO, Pharmaceutical products, also known as medicines or drugs, are special preparations used in modern and traditional medicine. They are essential for the prevention and treatment of diseases and protection of public health. What does a new product mean in pharmaceutical marketing? A new molecule can be a new product that is yet to be available in Bangladesh or a new doses form, a new strength or a new combination, even a new pack size can be a new product. When Belastin and Cipro Fibrate was launched first time in Bangladesh, these molecules were become a new product. Sodium picosulfate was available in Bangladesh and then it was launched as a combination product with magnesium oxide and anhydrous citric acid. So this combination product became a new product. Ceterigin was available as tablet, syrup, pediatric drop doses form. And when ceterigin hydrochloride soft gel capsule became available, it became a new product. Atorvastigin 10 mg and 20 mg was available. And when the new strength 40 mg was launched, this new strength became a new product. And finally, a back size change can be a new product, especially for that company. Launching a first time in Bangladesh product is always a pride. And every company likes to highlight how many first time in Bangladesh product they have launched. Recently launched combination product of empagliflozin and linagliptin. A lot of companies has launched this combination product at a time and interestingly all of them claimed the first time in Bangladesh because to get the first mover advantage and new product is the growth engine of a company. Product management department can contribute a lot by launching time demanded molecules to support the sales growth and market share of that company. And we know the key person of a brand, the brand in charge. One of the core capabilities of a brand in charge is searching, selecting, and launching time demanded new molecules. So a brand in charge should know the features need to be evaluated to select a promising new product. Four features need to be considered to select a new product. And the first is potency, how potent the drug is, how effective the drug is, is it safe or not? 
and does it keep patient compliance? Let's see some example. When safety button was launched, it was highlighted safe and potent than conventional. Delafloxacin, highly effective against methicillin resistance, Staphylococcus aureus, and Pseudomonas aeruginosa. Paracetamol is a very safe drug to treat fever and pain. And finally, when pregabalin became available with different doses, form and strength is a convenient solution to treat neuropathy pain and nerve rooted pain. So a brand in charge should evaluate this four point critically and very cautiously. From where to get the information about a promising product to launch? especially from current journals and scientific sessions of International Congress and CME and Doctor Society programs. Here I have given some example of renowned medicine journals like Journal of American Medical Association, New England Journal of Medicine, The Lancet, Expert Opinion on Investigational Drugs, there are hundreds and thousands of journals are every day publishing all over the world. So a brand in just can follow those journals. And he or she can also read the specialty based journals like Circulation on Cardiology, Diabetes Care on Diabetology, Obstetrics and Gynecology, or the Journal of Psychiatry, etc. Brand in charge should follow the scientific sessions of international congresses to get the updates on disease, medicines, and treatment options. This session is a very good source to have to know about a new product. He or she should also participate, especially in the scientific sessions of local CME and doctor society programs to know about the current medical treatment problems and probable solutions and recommendations of doctors about a new product. A brand in charge needs to know the regulatory issues in new product launching also. As a country with LDC status in the WTO, Bangladesh has an extension and implement TRIPS, pharmaceutical patent obligations till January 1st, 2033. This flexibility offers Bangladesh the opportunity to copy patented drugs for domestic consumption at affordable price as well as export them to the other markets, especially to LDCs. There is a great opportunity for Bangladesh pharma industry to launch promising molecules and new products. Our local regulatory authority is Director General of Drug Administration. No drug can be launched in Bangladesh without having the prescribed approvals from this regulatory authority. A brand in charge should know another very important thing, the Drug Control Committee. Because to launch a molecule first time in Bangladesh, First of all, you need to have the approval from Drug Control Committee and Drug Control Committee only approves those drugs that has US FDA, UKMHRA, EMA, BNF, PMDA Japan or TGA Australia approval or recommendation. Launching a new product first time in Bangladesh is a lifetime achievement and always a pride for a brand in charge. As a professional, 
he or she can contribute the best by launching time demanded new product that's all for today in our next video we will discuss about steps to launch a new product first time in Bangladesh and role of a branding charge thanks for watching